Hey everybody, so today we're unboxing this beauty. This is a Dyson Ball Animal 2, uh, one of the newest um, vacuums up from Dyson. I'm really excited about this one because it's supposed to have some of the strongest suction of any vacuum out there, actually the strongest. So I'm really interested to see what it's like. Um, we have another Dyson. We have a Dyson uh, V6 Absolute, which is fantastic. It's a little smaller, a little lighter. This one I'm looking forward to really being able to suck up a lot of pet hair and dander and kids messes, you know, if you're a parent. So it comes with a lot of stuff. We're going to take a look in the box really quickly, but it has a tangle-free turbine tool, a pet tool, a articulating tool for uh, between uh, hardwood floors, stiff bristle brush, a combination tool, a stair tool, plus the regular head, which I'm excited about because it is supposed to work really well on both carpet and hardwood and automatically adjust. Okay, so let's take a look. Um, just quickly, I'll give you the measurements on this. This weighs a little under 20 pounds at 17.39, uh, about 7.89 kilograms. Uh, and as you can see, it feels pretty heavy. I think it's all of that. So let's take a look inside. Yeah, do that. Comes open pretty nicely. Alright. I'm going to have to pull it all out from the inside. Ooh, look at that. All sorts of goodies. Packaging. We have some tools here. Here we have the uh, main head. More tools, fantastic. And this looks like part of the handle. More packaging. Make sure it doesn't get broken in the package, don't it? There we go. This is part of the handle. And this is the main unit. I'm going to be a little delicate with this here. So if we can get it out, we may have to push and open the other side. I don't want to take any chances on breaking this. Of the unit. That looks like a really nice sturdy piece. Some more tools. We'll take a look at those individually. And we'll just set the packaging back there. Alright, let's just take a look at how this is to assemble. It's the main part. We've got the cord. Register an instruction booklet. You might want to think about registering for a warranty. Take this off. And we'll just set it up. That pops back on. Just like that. And we have a guys aside for now. Nice and simple. Looks like it just slides on right here. If you can see, there's a little tab and this. And line it up properly. If we knew what we were doing that would work really well. There we go. There you go. Once you figure out where the tabs go, it's a piece of cake. It slides right on. And we're almost there. We've got this. We attach this big long handle to it. Found the instructions, which are super easy. And it's actually really easy to do. I just didn't see them at first. This goes on the very top. Take 
this fits, I believe, right in here. Okay, this is actually pretty simple. Take this, take the long extension, slide it all the way in. But you have to press that little knob to do it, otherwise it sticks. Pull it all the way in. Nice and cozy. Make sure that it, the button faces this way. Slide that up, and there's a little tab here, right there, and down, and you've got it. That's set to go. How beautiful is that beast, huh? Okay, so we'll set that down. We'll take a quick look at some of the attachments that came with it. Right here we have a small brush attachment. Oh, quite a few ones, a nice long one. A, uh, a smaller upholstery attachment, some connectors. We have here what looks like it could be a really great articulating brush attachment for between two levels of hardwood floors. And a really awesome attachment for pet hair. If you have pets, you know what I mean. All right, thank you. Mm -hmm.